First is for inspiration in robotics, science, and technology. It's, the saying is, this is one sport where everybody can go pro. I would like to become an engineer. I want to be an electrical engineer. Mechanical designing. Software engineer or computer engineer. What General Motors is trying to do here is to inspire these kids, show the kids that the robot project is just like a GM car project and that they can have fun doing this, and in fact, they can have a bright future at General Motors going forward. This competition is a mentor-based competition where the mentors basically are not only helping the students build a robot, but also sharing their professional experiences with the students. Without mentors and sponsors, our team wouldn't be where it is today. Sponsors fund all of the engineering that we do, and mentors are there to teach us that engineering. Being able to put your hands on um, the robot and just seeing your robot out there is very exciting. Beware the chickens. I remember my first year being a judge five years ago, and I saw this uh, freshman um, student, a girl, and she was so shy. And by her junior year, she was the spokesperson for the team, and she says this first that taught her all the confidence and gave her the passion for engineering. I believe we're like a family. I mean, this is not really, it's my first year and everybody's so nice and kind to me. And I'm a driver, so that counts for something. GM loves being a team sponsor at first because not only do we get to have our employees interact with students and just, just get that infectious enthusiasm, but it gives us the engineers of tomorrow. And being here, it gives you like real, real world um, experiences. So it's actually, I think it will benefit me in the future. These students really, uh, show tremendous talent, much more than one could ever imagine at the high school level. We have over 300 engineers that work at General Motors that started out in first, went on to engineering school, and now work with us building great cars and trucks every day.